that's where we're going to apply our product yeah and these will blend if you're gentle with them you don't have to be like super gentle but if you apply too much product you'll know yeah, it won't blend yeah you'll know um yeah, you can see face, <laughs> yeah we're basically we're literally just being a face she is just doing what we would really do to our human just mm. on a very much smaller scale i mean actually it's pretty much the size of the head not really but and so i'm just giving her a bit more shape just so she looks a little bit more yeah. alive when it comes to um noses you can like pinch a brush or if you've got a little fan brush and then that will help you create that yeah like that shape of that curve down the nose i think her nose a little bit no it's all right it was looking a bit lopsided from that direction but it's very minimal and it just makes her look a little bit more like a human yeah what my girl my lovely lady did with that one was she knew that she wanted to use like loads of pink all over the face so you're just coloring it with the shade you'd use if I was doing this for someone with darker skin, I might dust this base shade all over yeah. and then go in with a darker shade if I want to make a point of the skin tone. But this lovely lady is very Caucasian, bless her. <laughs> um, so that's what we're going with. That's just our basic, yeah? Then I will put some stuff up of the difference between day and evening makeup. <laughs> but we're all there, yeah. But, um, Let's just do a day makeup for now. So day makeup is generally very natural. Um, when I, I probably will do them next week actually. When I show you how to apply foundation, I do it quite gently. You'll realise like um, you you want to build your foundation regardless of the foundation you're using, so it's not super cakey. Double sponge. Um, so we don't use sponges in the industry actually. We only use.